and a breaking news development to start off your Sunday morning. Viewers and subscribers, please smash that bell next to the subscribe button and turn on all, all my notifications. Please comment on this video, like this video. I'm hoping um, we're gearing up to hopefully 100 likes and hopefully 75 to 100 comments because engagement and interaction is key. Stay tuned to the end of the video for Q&As, giveaways, shoutouts, and more coming your way here on Sean's View Team, where I keep it prolific, consistent, and dedicated. So, ladies and gentlemen, this was kind of out of nowhere. Um, <clears throat> moving Brock Lesnar to SmackDown isn't out of the realm of possibility in 2017. SmackDown is doing, has been doing well since the brand split, so adding Brock Lesnar would be a massive boost to keep that momentum going through 2017. And frankly, there could be more opportunity for him on SmackDown. He's been announced for more WWE live events in February and March. What is really interesting is Brock Lesnar has also been confirmed for an appearance at the WWE live event in Madison Square Garden a few weeks before the grandest stage of them all. I apologize for my voice. I'm terribly sick. I got a hell of a snowstorm outside of my house. I'm snowed in. Um, my electricity's been going on and off. There's just all kinds of things going on. So please just bear with me. The interesting thing about that is the event is for SmackDown and not Raw. It's not out of the question for Brock Lesnar to be featured on a SmackDown card, especially for a WWE live event being held out of Madison Square Garden. The question that some people are asking is if WWE officials would consider moving Lesnar to SmackDown after WrestleMania. It's been rumored that there will be another WWE draft and someone like AJ Styles could move brands as well. And obviously that would not be a positive momentum booster for Monday Night Raw, but it would do huge things for SmackDown, although Brock Lesnar is only a part time fixture, but still it would mix up feuds and scenarios, and the fact that Brock Lesnar is a part-timer and only shows up, does it really matter if he's on SmackDown or Raw? The fact that Brock Lesnar has not been on SmackDown since, what, 2004? And I'm talking about actually being on the Raw, so I'm not just talking about showing up and attacking somebody or, um, you know, just having something to do, to, to do with the blue brand, and I just woke up, by the way. Um, I got to get some sleep in there, at least a couple hours, right? I mean, I do work around the clock, but there comes a time we got to have a couple times, a couple hours of sleep at least. But, um, or, you know, and I'm not talking about, you know, invasions or something like that. I'm talking about Brock Lesnar being included on the SmackDown roster. Hasn't it been since like 2004, WrestleMania 20? So viewers and subscribers, what do you think about this move? WWE thinking about moving Brock Lesnar to SmackDown to mix things up. But, once again, the rumor goes on to state that someone huge from SmackDown would move to Monday Night Raw to offset things. And that superstar probably would be AJ Styles or maybe Randy Orton. So, viewers and subscribers, obviously, this is a huge update. This is a breaking news development. Something I didn't expect. Something I didn't see coming. But, viewers and subscribers, now we can get new feuds and mix-ups out of this. And, um, does it, um... Does this really uh, change anything? Um, I think it does, and I, I think it will have a different feeling. And now, you know, Brock Lesnar can go suplex city on SmackDown Live. Now, once again, viewers and subscribers, to be eligible to be entered into the Xbox One drawing, all you do is like my official Facebook fan page, which is in the description of this video, or in the comment section, and put on my page, you have to put hashtag Sean's View and enter, and you will automatically be eligible. Now, there's going to be another giveaway coming, so look out for that. And please go check out all my videos at DSD. I did a bunch, a bunch of videos yesterday on news, rumors, and headlines in WWE. When you work around the clock, you're going to, you're going to expect a lot of videos out of me each and every day, I hope, uh, concerning the WWE rumor mill. Uh, that's why it's very crucial and important to click the bell next to the subscribe button to never, ever miss an upload from me and turn on all my notifications. Your comments and your opinions on Brock Lesnar moving brands. More to come. Stay tuned. Don't go anywhere.